Aberdeenshire Council has a legal duty to conserve biodiversity. We also support the sustainable management, protection and improvement of all landscapes. There is concern about the loss of or damage to landscapes, habitats and biodiversity due to construction, quarrying and environmental engineering for flood control. The Aberdeenshire Local Development Plan includes policies that seek to protect Aberdeenshire's landscapes, biodiversity and geodiversity, such as our rocky northern coastline. It doesn't extend to the Cairngorms National Park, which has its own local development plan. Policy E1, Natural Heritage, provides protection to species and nature conservation sites. These sites are broken down into three categories. Internationally important sites are areas of land and or water that are protected by the European Parliament. These are places of the highest environmental quality or contain rare and protected species that may be on the endangered list. Nationally protected sites are selected by Scottish Natural Heritage for their high quality or rarity. Within Aberdeenshire we have a number of sites of special scientific interest and two national nature reserves. Finally, we have sites that are identified by Aberdeenshire Council called Local Nature Conservation Sites and Local Nature Reserves. These are the most common of our protected sites in Aberdeenshire and are designated for their local biodiversity or geological importance. Development is only permitted on protected sites where the public benefit outweighs the conservation value and any negative impact is minimised. The fragmentation of habitats protected or not, should be avoided, and habitat networks, which form part of the wider green network, should be maintained and improved. Policy E2 protects Aberdeenshire's landscapes from development that would have a negative impact on the characteristics of that landscape, as defined in the landscape character assessments produced by Scottish Natural Heritage, or have been identified as a landscape of local importance by Aberdeenshire Council, known as Special Landscape Areas. The Local Development Plan also contains policies that safeguard watercourses, trees and woodlands from development that would sterilise or degrade it. Improving our natural environment is an important part of Aberdeenshire Council's duty to enhance biodiversity. Policy E1 in the Local Development Plan expects all developments to provide opportunities that maintain or improve biodiversity proportionate to its scale. More detail is provided in Policy P2 open space and access to new development and within the Shaping Places chapter. If you want to know more about the Aberdeenshire Local Development Plan, please visit our website, which includes a Frequently Asked Questions webpage, follow us on Twitter and Facebook, or watch our other short films on specific topics. Thank you.